We came down to NYU area to get Farouk Halal because it's our last night here so we really want to give them like a local experience. Night after drinking soju, plot is essential. Hezakbok. Much needed. Good morning! We are on the way to Ruby's Cafe right now for first science flight so we are kind of on like a tight time but let's hope we don't have to wait too long because I really want her to try Ruby's Cafe. Let's see. As expected it is gonna be an hour wait so we're gonna go kill time by going to Bed Bath. I feel like I'm gonna over order because we waited so long in line. We went to the bath on my grocery and just like run errands, and we still haven't been seated. So you can imagine how starving we are. the next morning I'm now gonna go to the gym to start off my day because movement is medicine and it helps me kind of start my day right so and I also feel a little puffy because of all the leftovers I had last night so hopefully getting this movement in will kind of help me deep puff this morning and then I'll get started on with my day okay let's go Hello, hello, good afternoon. Hi, it is the next day after I sent my cousin off yesterday. After hosting a guest, the house has been a little messier. Not because of them, but also like the dogs just get overly excited. They think they can act however they want. So I am starving, but I gotta declutter this place first because I don't even have a place to sit because of the mess. So let's get started, shall we? For lunch, I will be making BLT sandwich. I have been craving this sandwich for quite some time and in order for me to make the sandwich, can you believe, I had to go to four different grocery stores because every time I went to each one of them, I forgot to get the other ingredient and then I forgot to get the other ingredients. So it's been around two days in the making of groceries, but I have all the ingredients now. <sighs> Starving and I'm just so excited to eat. I have all my ingredients laid out here, so let's make my BLT sandwich. Ah, so excited! Bon appetit, everyone! Bon appetit. Does Nata want some lunchy? How about I give you snacky later? <gasps> you want it now? Okay, let's go. Oh, so excited for my lunch. I am just gonna finish up a K drama, The Glory that I've been watching. Oh, go, go, go. 
I just finished having lunch and it is the new year so I am gonna change out our wall art art wall I don't know you tell me how do you say this so let's unbox this and get to work oh they're huge they're a little big way too big Okay, so it came with these pieces. I am assuming that I need to screw this piece to the back here and then use this to mount it, right? Mm. Honestly, this is why I should just stay in the kitchen. I accidentally cut myself pretty bad. The blood has stopped dripping. I'm just putting more pressure just to stop the bleeding. Ugh. Things though. Moment of truth. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh. Oh, I did it! Okay, next one. Voila! I don't know how stable this is because it did knock down a few times. I just finished work and it is somehow already dinner time. So for dinner, I am going to be making tteokbokki. Tteokbokki is a Korean rice cake dish with some spice sauce. I have been craving for the longest time but like when my cousin was here so I haven't really had the time to cook at home. So I'm super excited to eat this and just binge watch whatever Netflix show there is. Let's get started. 150 ml of water. I already defrosted my rice cake so I'm just going to put this in here. Forget the fish tofu. When there's carbs, let there be protein. So I made some boiled eggs to put over the tteokbokki. Mmm, so excited to eat. Let's take a look. So my tteokbokki looks so good. This is kulpisu. Kulpisu is usually it comes with spicy food in Korean, like super super spicy because it really helps to calm down that spice that you can't take. I know this tteokbokki is not that spicy, but it kind of reminds me of the childhood when I would eat like super spicy Korean food on the streets, and sometimes you would have this. And I'm just gonna finish watching Glass Onion. Catch you later. Good evening! I have finished all my things to do today and it is officially time to clean myself up and get ready for bed. It doesn't matter what your everyday looks like. My holy grail, my staple, my baby, my hard work, my everything. <laughs> get unready with me. I. You don't need that much. I just get a very thin layer of maybe like a quarter size. Melt it into your hands and just massage in a circular motion. This is literally the step I look forward to like every night and every morning. I almost feel like this is like the it product that restores my skin while also evens out my like skin tone. Do you see what I mean? This glossiness. The moment you wash it off with water, it'll give the same kind of effect, which is so nice and soothing. Oh, okay. I'm now gonna hop in the shower and see you in a bit. I am now in my bed doing some self care. I try to do face masks at least once or twice a week, especially during winter days, just because my skin gets so dry. So today is that day. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video, and I really hope to see you next time. <laughs>